Hey, so welcome guys again to my channel. Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how to get the latest record from the database. So let's say you have a database with the posts, can be tags, can be users. How do you get the latest record? Okay, so to do that, I've just installed a new Laravel um, project and uh, I'm running it in the local OSIP 1000. Okay, and I've, some, I've done some edits like I've removed the data that is usually here and changed the title to get record from the database. I've included here all users and here the latest user. So under all users, we are going to get all the users from the database and display them here. And then down here, we are going to get the latest user and I'm going to show you three methods of doing that. So let's look at the project. So first, in the local loss, I have uh, this database called school, and that is the database that our project is using. And I have table posts and users. So in the table users, I populated a few users, which are 10 users. So we want to get all these 10 users and display them in the all users section. And then you are going to get the latest user and display him or her in this latest user section. So let's look at the code. So I am doing this from the web welcome.blade.php file because I didn't want to create controller and do all stuff like that. But if I just do it here, you'll understand how to, to do it using the controller. Okay, so the first thing is to include the PHP tags. like that and then inside these tags we are going to include the we are going to include the db facade because you are going to use the db facade to to fetch users data from the database so users equals to db and then the table so the table is users so if your table was named post, then you will put your posts, but in my case it's users. And then um, I'm going to get the latest, uh, not latest actually, first we are getting all the users. So just get like that. So this will populate these users variable with all the users from the database. Okay, so down here now I'm going to pull all those users and display them here. So I've already pulled them, but I just want to display them here. So we'll do and for each. So for each collection is users as user. Let's just remove this. So it's good we use we do, we put this inside the uh, inside the the ul tags. We can just do, we can just do div and then we can use that uh, like that. Maybe we can use a paragraph like that. And let me just correct this. Can throw an error. So inside here, I just want to display user name so i'll just do user first user and then the name of the user so let's save that and go back to the browser and refresh and there we go all the users have been fetched and are now being displayed here okay so these are the users that are in this database these are the users as you can see the last year is lila and uh, is the user that you're having here as the last user so that is it so let's look at how you can get the latest user and display here so there are three methods you are going to use the first uh, let me define the latest equals to db and then table that table is users and then 
latest and you want to fetch by id so latest you play the id and then you get the first like that so this is going to bring the the latest user so we can just display here you can use paragraph and then display that user just do let oh, okay latest so this time let's display the email we can just display the name anyway we can just display the name so let's refresh and see and there we go we have the latest user you see the latest user is here here but uh, and we have now put that user and we are displaying the user here so that is the first method and said i'm going to show you three methods right let's look at the second method so the second method just the latest and let me define it as latest two equals to db table and then the table name is users and then you want to order by use order by id and then descending and then fast like that so this is going to get the latest scissor too so let's just comment this out the latest and use the latest too let's save that and then here we'll use the latest too so let's save that and look at it again and we still we have him still you have that user so that is also pulling the latest user so let us look at the last um the last method that is method number three so i'll call it the latest three but now this time i'm going to use the to use eloquent so i'll do latest three is equals to equals to up this time round i'm using eloquent users app user latest fast so get the user and then the latest and then the first so that is what you do to get the latest user that i'm using eloquent here so let's well, so that is how to get the latest user from the database. Thank you so much guys and see you in the next tutorial.